What's up YouTube friends? Welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody had a great New Year celebration. Now, I'm super excited for 2023. I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm excited. Hopefully you guys are too. Now, for today's video, I'm going to keep moving forward with some viewer suggestions that I got off the socials. And I'm a little bit familiar with this comedian, but in a general sense. Now, I've never really seen a stand-up, so this is going to be completely new for me. But you know what? I'm super excited. Hopefully you guys are too. So you know what? Let's just see how this goes. What a crowd, huh? Yeah, they love you. Really nice. Don't get, how you doing? Okay? I'm doing fine. That's You're great. looking real good. Yeah? Real good. <laughs> yeah. Big movie coming out, huh? Oh, everything is going good. Everything yeah. is okay, yeah. Bought a house out here? I bought a house. Out here? You know, in Connecticut, I bought a house. Westport. Westport? Oh, yeah. Nice place, Connecticut, yeah. That's very high class. Almost from Connecticut. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a nice place up there. Westport, I bought a house up there, Johnny, you know, and it's really uh -huh. nice. The town is nice. People are nice, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I got nice neighbors over there, too, and... But last week, I played tennis with my neighbors, you know, Marianne and Biff. Marianne and Biff? <laughs> you ought to come up there, you know me? Yeah? Spend a few days, you and I relax, they don't bother you. It's nice, have a good time, just you and I alone. Don't sure. You want to bring it along, too? <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> No, nah, but I've been working hard, Johnny, and I'm trying to relax, you know? Yeah. I, got, uh, I go to Las Vegas next week, the resort's here for that. I got an album coming out, a movie coming out. I'm working very hard. Yeah. Well, you know, my father, he was a workaholic. Really? Oh, yeah. You mentioned work, he got drunk. I did not. <laughs> 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 well, I finally solved my drinking problem. I joined Alcoholics Anonymous, you know. Wouldn't it? Yeah, I still drink. I use a different name. That's all. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I tell you, my problem is I drink too much, way too much. Yeah. I got my doctor a urine specimen. There was an olive in it. <laughs> I mean, when I drink, I don't know what I'm doing. I was loaded one night, I went into a gay bar. Who was ridiculous. There was 15 guys for every guy. <laughs> this is on full. Yeah. This is on full. Yeah. on full. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, I'm never lucky in bars. Uh, I saw a sign of a one bar. It said topless, bottomless. I went inside. There was no one there. <laughs> Life ain't easy. Well, I mean, nothing works. So you, I decided to look out for number one, and I stepped to number two. <laughs> I like his speed with it. It's just like really quick. <laughs> and smoking, that's another one. Yeah. Try to stop smoking, that's a beauty, huh? Well, with cigarettes, my wife and I, we made a deal, my wife and I. We yeah. only smoke after sex. I got the same pack now since 1975. <laughs> <laughs> what bothers me is my wife. She's up to three packs a day. <laughs> the truth and my wife and I we never have sex. No. Now we get undressed, we can't stop laughing. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but I'll tell you one thing, when my wife does have sex, she screams. Oh, yeah. especially when I walk in on her. Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> now you can I know my wife cheats on me. Every time I come home the parrot says quick out the window, you know? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, my house, my house, I can't relax. Really? I, got my, I got a dog, he drives me nuts. Oh. I got a dumb dog, you know? We call him Egypt. Every room, he leaves a pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> my kids, they don't help either. You no know? good, huh? Ooh, no, my kids, they're real smart kids I got, you know? Yeah. But the other day, I told my kid, I said, someday you'll have children of your own. He said, so are you. <laughs> Mean kid, a very mean kid. He scotch tapes worms to the sidewalk, then watches the birds get hernias. Are you kidding me? Mean kid, Johnny. Mean. It's a mean kid. Mean kid. And my daughter, too. She's no bargain either, my daughter. Are you kidding? Well, she's been picked up so many times, she's starting to grow handles. Oh. I mean, you're kidding. Her graduation book, her picture is horizontal. It's ridiculous. Oh. <laughs> well, they call her Federal Express, you know. What's that? Yeah, when she goes to a guy's apartment, she absolutely positively has to be there over <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay. 
I mean, I've had some trouble with kids. They play around so young today, very young. I was talking to my doctor. You know my doctor, Dr. Vinnie Boombach. You know my doctor? Yeah. Yeah. Well, he told me last week in his office he got six cases of VD. I mean, he's all right now, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's a strange doctor. Strange oh, doctor. Hey, you're kidding. I asked him if my heart was strong enough to sex. He told me not if I join in, you know? <laughs> 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 and this girl was no bargain either. She was fat. Who? Fat, huh? No fat. <laughs> right, when she wears high heels, she strikes oil, okay? She's fat. <laughs> fat, you kidding? Fat, huh? Fat, big, you big girl. Oh, I met her at the Macy's parade. She was wearing ropes. <laughs> oh. I mean, fat. When she was on the Richard Simmons show, jumping up and down, my TV fell off the stand. Oh. I'm talking about a fat girl Big here, you know girl. what I mean? Big, <laughs> Big girl, you're kidding, she was standing alone, a cop told her to break it up, you know. <laughs> I mean, I this girl was fat and ugly. Ooh, was she ugly? Ugly. How ugly? I took her to the beach. They asked me what I used for bait. Oh. <laughs> 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 When I took her home, my mother put newspapers on the floor. Oh. I mean, ugly. I gave her a hickey and got fur on my mouth. Oh. <laughs> and that's how ugly she was. <laughs> if I had the right trio, I could make yeah. it, you know that? So how are you, Rodney? <laughs> We got a film clip, right, hey. from your picture. That's right, yeah. It's called, what is the name of this picture? Thanks for being so well informed. <laughs> Easy. I know you do a zebra. What else do you do? <laughs> Easy Money is called. Easy Money. Yeah. You the star of this picture? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's tough making a movie, I'll tell you that. Is it really tough? Should have been called Tough Buck. Really? <laughs> You got a lot of money now. Does it make you happier? Money don't mean nothing. You know yeah. that. You got the same head. Money don't mean nothing. Yeah. It's just, uh, you know, you're the same guy, you know? Yeah. You haven't changed then. Suddenly, I'm depressed. <laughs> <laughs> Does this uh, excerpt we're going to see need any, uh, as they say, set up at all? Well, uh, in a movie, you know, I'm a baby photographer. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> And what I do is, I, in this movie here, I'm like, uh, I try to turn over a new leaf, you know? I stop drinking, uh, stop gambling, stop overeating, and a few other things I won't go into. And, uh, <laughs> and this is, I'm in withdrawal now, sort of trying to stop. And this clip shows me what happens when I'm a baby photographer after I've stopped all these things. I'm not quite myself. Okay, from, uh, here it is. Easy money. Easy money. <laughs> you gotta stay still, okay? You gotta stay still, okay, kid? You gotta stay still here. Kid, you gotta stay still. Oh, dear. Have you ever seen your face like that before? No, no. If I did, I'd remember it. Gonna no, no. get a real good picture now, okay? Look at him. He's got my eyes. He's got my nose. And my sympathy. Oh. <laughs> wallet size picture, too. This kid won't fit no wallet size. My wife's very particular. What about you, John? He's very particular, too. <laughs> Surprise you married each other. All right. Look, kid, I'm tired of keep telling you the same thing. You gotta stay still, all right? I, I'll tell you what. Look, Anthony, I'm gonna make a deal with you, okay? Anthony, Come here. Pay attention. Okay, Anthony, come here. You, you gotta stay still, Anthony. We're gonna get a good picture, Anthony. We gotta stay still. We wanna get a good picture, Anthony. Stay still. Stay still. Stay still. Come the kid out, will you? Stay still. Here we go, Anthony, will you?
Uh, you have a way with kids. Huh? You have a way with kids. I love kids. Uh, <laughs> well, I hope it's a big hit for you. Thank you so much. Comes out a week and a day. Easy money. Yeah, Friday. Next Friday it opens and yeah. theaters everywhere. Nationwide. That's what they say. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll take a break. We'll be right back. <laughs> All right. So... I thought that was hilarious. Now, I'm not 100% familiar with everything Rodney Dangerfield has done. I mean, I do know that, you know, he's been in some movies, he does stand-up, and I'm mostly familiar with, I guess, his movies because I've seen a few of them going back to kind of rewatch some of the things that I wouldn't have actually watched in the past. Um, and I've enjoyed it. The comedy is very different from today, though. I do have to say that a lot of the stuff that he seems to talk about just doesn't fit because he's either making fun of somebody or, uh, you know, a scenario or something, or it's just kind of something that, you know, I guess today you don't really talk about. And I still really like it. I like the way that comedy was set previously, and I just like being able to laugh at myself and everything else around me. And, I mean, if you can't really do that, then is it really comedy? And I think, you know, that's what he hits. And his one-liners are just very authentic, and I like that for comedians. And I think that's actually something that's really hard to find today because everyone's just so scared of saying things because it, there's just a lot that's really, you know, politically incorrect and everybody fears at this point. But Rodney Dangerfield is very, very authentic and I love it all and all though I did enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys did too. If you did, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. Also make sure to hit that little notification button that way you guys know when I drop my next video. And if you get the chance, check out my Twitch streams on Wednesdays and Fridays. Just check my page for the times. Well, thanks for joining me here today, everybody. Stay spicy, my friends.